as much as we have uh, the resources in terms of personnel, security personnel, this kind of misuse of uniformed officers should not be acceptable, Mr. Speaker. We have seen Kenyans in Turukana, in Kapedo, people are struggling even to access basic needs because of insecurity, Mr. Speaker. Why bring GSU officers at the stadium where innovations are ongoing, where people are very peaceful, when we have issues to deal with? This national government is failing on its mandate, Mr. Speaker. The same energy they use to blackmail and intimidate politicians, they should use to lower the cost of living that's affecting the many Kenyans that we have. Mr. Speaker, sir, going forward, going forward, I appeal, Mr. Speaker, finally, I appeal also with our members of the counter assembly, Mr. Speaker, that an attack to the office of the governor is an attack to the people of Kisi County because he's the national, is the leader and the symbol of unity in this county. Thank you, Mr. Speaker. Honorable members, you stay right way of clapping. Let me be fair to Honorable Michael, because Honorable Michael don't see, and I may solve Honorable Michael. It is your time. Let your Honorable Michael finish first. Thank you. This way. Oh, okay. <clears throat> Thank you. Thank you, Speaker, for the opportunity. And uh, I also want to rise up to support this uh, very important motion by the Honorable Bundari pertaining the security that was a bit threatened yesterday in our